Maryland controller Peter Francho arrived at Delaney High School this morning bearing promises. I can pretty much guarantee you that uh, Delaney is going to get a new replacement, state-of-the-art, modern high school. A promise he made before, during, and after his tour of Delaney today, with parents as tour guides pointing out the immediate issues with the aging building structure and systems, starting with no air conditioning. Can you see me sweating? That's some of it. Um, obviously the inequity that's in this building as far as the classrooms that are antiquated and dangerous. There's also a crumbling foundation, brown drinking water, busted floors, burst pipes. Our electrical panel is an original to the building from 1954. We have a crumbling porous wall that floods. We've been in school for three weeks. We've had two flooded classrooms. Parents don't want a renovation, they want a replacement. In a recent vote, the Baltimore County School Board agreed. And today, the guy who balances Maryland's checkbook vowed to do whatever it takes to make that happen. Sooner rather than later, and it will be because of the Board of Public Works. This is not an issue of duct tape and caulking. This school needs to be completely replaced with something that the kids deserve. And you can watch that process play out in person. The State Board of Public Works on October 18th will be holding a complete review, Mr. Franchot told us, of every jurisdiction's school construction budget. Reporting live in Timonium tonight, I'm Kate Amara, WBAL TV 11 News. All right.